today you are at Merrill Street Community Garden across the street from the Hazel Park School District office. Um, it is our fourth annual flower and plant sale. Um, we have the Merrill Street Community Garden here and the Hazel Park Flower Club here, both raising money for their um, organizations. The Flower Club plants the pots around the city and the Merrill Street Community Garden manages the community garden here for renters. Um, this year we added a pop-up uh, trunk sale. So across the street here we have people sell selling their goods and wares out of their trunk. Um, there's some community groups talking about their organizations, giving some information out. Um, over here we have vegetables, uh, perennials, and annual flowers um, for sale um, across the street. They've got some cool stuff from here. I can see somebody's got a boat uh, and some other cool stuff. Um, it is chilly out here, but it's nice to be outside and we're having a good time. also have um, honey for sale from our bees uh, here at the community garden. Our beekeeper is here today doing demonstrations. Bees right now, uh, we have two hives in uh, the pot of uh, garden in Hazel Park, City of Hazel Park. Uh, bees are now just uh, growing up, preparing for uh, uh, flow season for nectar season to start to make honey. This is honey from last year what I have. This is a uh, 12 ounce jar, honey from last year. And then what I make, I have some uh, mix of honey, uh, pollen and royal jelly. As you know, royal jelly is uh, food for the queen because queen only get feed the whole life with royal jelly. Pollen is also those uh, minerals what the bees use to feed the babies. So mixing honey, uh, adult bees they eat honey. Mixing the pollen, honey and royal jelly, that is good for uh, making uh, your body immune system better. So um, if you come on out you might be able to put on a bee suit and get up close and personal and learn some about the bees we have here at Mill Street Community Garden. <laughs>